My name is Darnell Moore. Um, I am a visiting scholar in the Center for the Study of Gender and Sexuality at NYU. And I, in my nine to five, I work as the Director of Educational Initiatives for the Hetrick Martin Institute, which is all really home to the Harvey Milk School. And um, the reason why we're at the Center today is because we're talking about the Queer Newark History Project and Oral Archiving Project, um, of which I am uh, co-chair with Beryl Satter, who's Professor of History at Rutgers Newark. I actually was en route to becoming a professional minister. <laughs> I, I, was, I studied in seminary and thought that I would leave doing ministry, preaching um, behind pulpits, which ended up being me sort of preaching to pulpits about dis discriminatory practices and theologies that were discriminatory, or, or theologies that I consider to be violent against um, queer people. Um, and because of sort of institutionalized religion, not all, um, but in some ways really limiting me as a human being, I ended up uh, preaching, but it, uh, I guess my message was changed and, and the bodies that I was, was preaching to was different. Uh, and I started doing social activism, which I still see as um, in some ways and responding to a call towards social justice. I got to Newark um, by an invitation of a friend who lived there and fell in love with the city because of the sort of activist spirit that is present in the city. It has a rich history um, of folk who are social justice architects, people who really care uh, about the community and who absolutely want social change and are not afraid to, to fight for it. And I saw that as a perfect sort of energy that could catapult, at least in my own life, a black queer man who sees this urban space as a potential along with other community members for safe spaces created for queer people. And, um, and since I've been there, I've been doing a lot of fun things, working with the Newark Pride Alliance, um, helping them to develop educational initiatives of which we developed an after school program for queer youth there. And now being on the other end, working and developing and designing a high school are uh, loosely modeled at the Harvey Milk School in New York City. So, and uh, among a few other things.